In today's video, we're going to be checking out the Crush Pro 120 Solid State Amplifier by Orange Amplification, and we're starting right now. What's up, guys? Steve Reese here again from Does It Doom, where we feature weekly guitar lessons and gear demos in the stoner, doom, and sludge metal genre. So if that's your type of thing, please like this video, subscribe to the channel, and ring that notification bell for more weekly doom content. The Crush Pro 120 is a twin-channel, 120-watt solid-state amplifier inspired by the orange rocker verb. Except for the onboard digital reverb, the amp is entirely analog. We've got a vintage-inspired clean channel paired with a dirty channel based on that of the rocker verb featuring four stages of gain. The channels are foot-switchable, as is the digital reverb. Taking a look at the control layout on the front of the amp, we've got a global master volume that controls the overall output volume, a global reverb control that controls the overall level of the reverb effect on both channels, three digital reverb types, spring, hall, and plate, a dirty channel volume, the dirty channel treble, middle, and bass tone stack, along with the dirty channel gain. The clean channel features a treble and bass tone stack along with a volume control. As you increase that clean channel volume, you will start to get some natural breakup. The channels are switchable via this clean, dirty switch on the face of the amp. The amp will accept a single 8 ohm cab, a single 16 ohm cab or a pair of 16 ohm cabs. If you've got a pair of 16 ohm cabs and you want to daisy chain them, you can also run into a single speaker input at 8 ohms. As you can see, you've got send and return for the fully buffered effects loop, along with a foot switch input for the channel switching and reverb. In addition to the Crush Pro 120 head, we're going to be using an Epiphone G400 guitar, an Electro Harmonics Green Russian Big Muff reissue, a Proco Rat 2, and behind me a Mojo Tone 2x12 cab loaded with a pair of Celestian 70 watt B type speakers. We're going to be close miking the cab with a trusty Shure SM57 placed near where the dust cap meets the cone about an inch off the grill. If you're interested in any of that gear, you can find links to everything I just mentioned down in the YouTube description below.
All right, guys, I really hope you enjoyed that demo. If you did, please remember to smash that like button. Question of the day, do you prefer tube amps or solid state amps? I'm curious to know which and why. Let me know down in the comments. For more of my content, you can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook at Does It Doom, and you can subscribe to this YouTube channel by clicking the round subscription icon. If you're interested in learning Sonic Titans, some of which I played in this demo, you can check out the full lesson video here in this rectangle. So until next time, always remember, Tony Iommi is your friend.